The Liverpool Irish Festival got off to a start last Thursday, with the launch taking place at the Liverpool Irish Centre. Throughout the night, musicians, poets and singers took centre stage to kickstart the 17th year of the event. JMU Journalism spoke to festival director Emma Smith about how they keep on attracting big audiences and more. The 17th year of the Liverpool Irish Festival and every year surpass yourself with the numbers. What's your secret? Oh, uh, that's a good question. So this is my fourth year, so I can't comment on all of those that came before me. What we've really tried to do is think about what's really relevant to Liverpool and the Irish community here. So by developing an annual theme, We've really tried to take sort of storytelling to different levels and keep work that gives a thematic that people can sort of take a journey with us. And you said this is your fourth year in charge. What got you involved in this? So I've lived in Liverpool for longer than I was ever from my home place. And I'd worked primarily for all of my working life in Liverpool post-uni in arts and culture. So I knew a lot about the kind of arts and culture scene here and the venues here and had quite a strong network. So before this, I had worked at Blue Coat for a long time, uh, which is like the cultural hub for Liverpool. And then following that, I directed uh, a season for Look, the Liverpool International Photography Festival. So it's gone from an egalitarian art centre into sharing art in a festival sense, and then into thinking about, OK, well, if I can do that in one of these other areas, Irishness is a new lens. But actually it was really interesting and it made me think about the city that I'd chosen to live in, what its influences had been and to learn more about it. So yeah, it, it became something that I was really interested in and uh, fortunately got. <laughs> the Liverpool Irish Festival will run until the 27th of October.